And also, I, I, I do have a degree in mathematics. That's not the one that I did the rhyming dictionary for. Um, I love mathematics. Uh, but, you know, I'm not monogamous with mathematics. I love a lot of other subjects as well, like, like linguistics and... Okay, I don't really do microbiology, but I'm a programmer and I like particle physics and, and space and stuff. So, I'm more of a, a polymath, I guess. Um, but, although I love mathematics itself, uh, love is not really isomorphic to mathematics. It's, it's kind of more complicated to understand. So, I wrote a poem about that. And this is, I've never performed this version of it before ever on, on stage, so let's hope I remember it. Love is not mathematics, and it's hardly ever less than three. Rarely stops at man and woman, straight and gay, or you and me. Churning contradictions, clogging tubes in the definery that's turning quantum LGBT qubits into binary. Every single Boolean's in every state at once, and even when the Boolean's not single, it's still unsettlingly odd. And when it's not odd, then it is not even even. Oh my god, it's never simple. Nothing ever seems to normalize. I miss the clever symbols in the system that I formalize. And this I do not understand. It's just too complicated. I'm very good at solving, so it must be who I dated. Yes, love is not mathematics, but forgive it all confusion. Don't avoid all that dramatics with the trivial solution. Its axioms are ill-defined, but may prove good, or may prove well. If with your love you're thrilled to find you never have to prove yourself.